Hello everyone. There's a hundred of you now, so that's a super exciting. Thank you. Um, a little strange, but I'll take it. And I, I appreciate, I appreciate it. Um, wow, a hundred. That's so many. You know, I, I've been thinking about how to, how to celebrate this, and I'm going out for breakfast later with one of my friends to celebrate of a sort. Um, but I just, a hundred. That is the first big milestone that you can hit on YouTube. Oh, well, I mean, 50. Well, I feel like the milestones go one, 25, 50, 100. And after that, I, I don't know what the next milestone will be. I'm not entirely sure. But I, I think it's worth taking a moment. It's worth taking a moment to um, say thank you and to introduce myself. I'm sure a lot of you already know who I am or uh, I assume that you've probably watched some of my channel, but since since most of the uh, get to know me videos are fairly old now, I figured I would do another one. Um, I, hi, my name is JJ, JJ Hanna. I write suspense novels. Um, I write crime suspense novels. They're intense, they're fun, they're action packed, and they'll make you feel things. That's my intention, is to make you feel things, namely concern and care. I want you to care so deeply about my characters that when I do things to them, you feel it. Um, to, to be fair, I also want to give you the resolution afterward of having a, a good wrap-up to all of that. I am as of yet not published. I have no books out um, yet. Working on it, but I do have short stories. There are playlists of my short stories of me reading them here. There are also some short stories that I haven't read because they are designed to be visually seen. Um, there, so if, if those are all on my website, authorjjhanna.com. Um, I used to work as a literary agent. I have since stopped working as a literary agent. There was too many things that I was doing, and something had to go, and so that was. That was the thing that I released on my plate. But I still have all of the knowledge from working as a literary agent. Um, I have now moved into various different positions working in publicity um, for books and authors. That's exciting. I'm still working part-time as a barista. Now I work at Starbucks. Uh, so that's fun. I'm a Starbucks barista. <laughs> I get to wear the green apron. Um, Let's see. Yes, I can customize your drinks. Yes, I could give you ideas for certain character type drinks if you're interested in that sort of thing. I've seen a lot of people doing that on TikTok. Um, yes, I am on TikTok. You can, you can find me. Um, let's see. What else? I'm a nerd. I'm a nerd. That's, that's not a new one, though. If you're here, you probably knew it. If you didn't know it already, you can probably tell because of the TARDIS that you can see up peeking peeking out up there, um, and, and the Doctor Who figurines on my bookshelf, and the fact that they're right next to Sherlock, you know, the books. Um, I have Les Mis on my shelf. I haven't read it yet. I need to. It's one of those books that I want to take an entire year sometime to just read. Because I feel like it'll take me that long. <laughs> um, I read all sorts of things, but I mostly only talk about the suspense novels that I read. Um, but if you want to know what else I'm reading, you can follow me on Instagram. I'm most active on Instagram, TikTok, and YouTube. So, if you want the best up-to-datedness, those are the places to go. I do have merch. Um, this is one of them. This is my logo mug. Um, I also have vlog villain merch if you're interested in that sort of thing. Um, but... You know, you, you die, whatever. It's up to you. I made it for you if you want it. I also made it for me because I wanted it. <laughs> um, I hope that you are like me in a lot of ways. It, because because that 
means that you are the people that I want to hang out with. I, don't get me wrong, I love exchanging ideas with people, but when it comes to just spending time, being friends, um, I want to be able to talk nerd stuff, so talk nerd, <laughs> talk nerdy to me. I'm currently reading, uh, working my way through the most recent Trials of Apollo books uh, by Rick Riordan. I want to reread all of Percy Jackson and all of Harry Potter and all of The Hunger Games. Um, I have, I have, wherever it is, I have The Ballad of Songbirds and Snakes that I want to read. And I don't, I haven't decided if I want to read it before or after I reread the original trilogy for The Hunger Games. If you have any thoughts on that, let me know. Um, if you if you think it would be better to be read prior to or after, because I mean it's a prequel, but it was also released after. So I feel like I wish that I could read it for the first time twice. And so I'm I'm trying to decide which which way to do that. Um, I my books that I've been working on. I, that, there's an entire thing. If you're a writer, I'm trying to document my entire journey from unpublished to published author. I have a four book series completely drafted. Um, if you're a literary agent and you want to represent a crime suspense series, hit me up. Uh, let, let me know. There's a lot of found family. There's a lot of morally gray characters. Um, think of it as if Bucky Barnes adopted a child and took care of that child and multiple others. Um, while also t taking them on the run because they had a lot of bad people after them. Think of it that way. I, that's, that's my books in a nutshell. What would happen if Bucky Barnes adopted a couple of wayward children? Kind of. Kind of. Enough. It's enough of that. It's the vibe. Um, also, I have a cosplay and a I have ears. <laughs> um, if you go over on my TikTok, you can see me in cosplay. Um, I cosplay my original D and D characters, so that's that's fun. That's exciting. Um, let's see. I what do I what do I else what else what else? If you have questions, I love doing question videos, so I would love for you to just ask me your questions. Um, I'll answer them all as as I can. Um, okay, now that I've shown you the ears, I don't feel like I can not put them on for you. So, uh, shh, don't tell anyone. This is our secret. No one needs to know. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna do the end of the video this way because that's, that's fun. And this is me. And if this is not what you followed me for, I'm sorry. Um, but this is, this is what I do and who I am. Um, not the most professional, but eh, social media. I don't want to be professional all the time. So yes, I have elf ears. And yes, I occasionally wear wigs. And yes, I cosplay. Um, I, write, no, I write books. I read books. I watch TV shows. I'm a huge fan of Marvel TV show. Uh, well, working, working my way through the TV shows. I've watched all of the cinematic universe, though. Um... I like the DC TV shows as well. Um, superheroes are my jam. Vigilantes are even more my jam. If you like vigilantes, you'll like my books. Like I said, morally gray people doing good things with the wrong reasons and the, the wrong way of going about it. But that's, that's beside the point. Um, yeah, so th this is me. Uh, I am a Slytherin. If you didn't know already, I'm a Slytherin. Um, I'm a nerd. I, I watch Supernatural and Doctor Who and Sherlock, all of the big three, if you're in that part of Tumblr. Um, I am also on Tumblr. I have two accounts, so I bet you can't find my personal account. Yeah, I just want to hang out with you. So, uh, this is this is me. Thank you for 100 followers, subscribers. I am blown away by the fact that you've all managed to find me and that all of you, at some point or another, decided that you wanted to stick around. So thank you, and uh, if you like this sort of rambly 
video, you definitely should stick around if this is the first time you've ever, you know, seen me. Um, hi. <laughs> um, if this is the second or third, please stick around. I, I have fun. I like to talk about books. I like to analyze the writing. I like to analyze the storyline. If you're trying to become a writer, hopefully I can help you do that. Um, if you're trying to figure out what books are current, this is probably not the best place for you. I don't tend to keep up with trends very well, um, in large part because I'm an adult with an adult job and needing to make adult money. And unfortunately, the way that I have to go about doing that because I'm also pursuing a side career means that I don't have as much time to just binge books as I would like to. So I'll talk about books on occasion and you'll always see my bookshelf. I do have an entire series of just going through all of the books that I own if you're interested in that sort of thing. I know a lot of people like wish you could zoom in and see what books I have on my shelf. I've since rearranged my shelf, but the books are all still there. They're just not in the same order, so I might have to do another one of those. Let me know if that sounds fun or interesting, but um, I, will see, um, I will see you next time. <laughs> I've been rambling now. Uh, I'm so happy you're here. I'm so glad you're here. I, it really does mean a lot to me. Thank you. Thank you for 100. Until next time, I'll see you then. Bye. If you're still here, you should check out this and this. Um, maybe that. And, oh, as usual, don't don't forget to subscribe. What questions do you have? Like I said before, just put them down below and I'll, I'll answer them. I like you all. Okay, bye. <laughs>